Two of the nine city council members will formally present the entire body's plan to keep the city from going broke and just possibly keep an emergency manager out of Detroit. Gary Brown and Ken Cockrell Jr. are meeting with Mayor Bing's money man to lay out these recommendations. Some are just like the mayor's. The big difference? Councils calling for more than twice the number of layoffs. We're told the city is already running out of money. Right now, we're having vendors that are complaining that they're not being paid. We're having retirees complaining that they're not getting their last uh, uh, payout. And so, because that's happening, it, it, you know, we're already running out of cash. We're making a decision that if we pay those bills, we may not be able to make payroll. Following this afternoon's meeting, Brown and Cockrell will report back to their colleagues. Tomorrow, there'll be a vote and they could send their recommendations to Lansing. I think the key is that we drive those discussions to closure very quickly and come to some consensus, hopefully, as a council and as a mayor. Um, time is not our ally. The entire council wants to sit down with the unions Thursday morning to talk about concessions. But some unions may not be in a bargaining mood because six council members voted today to end the so-called 13th check, which gives retirees a bonus when their pension fund makes extra money. I tried to convey to them that that would have a chilling effect on any discussions we have with regards to negotiations. From downtown Detroit, Val Clark, 7 Action News.